And those, <laughs> those are PJs. Yo. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> Top right. Oh, God. <laughs> really? Quite a joke. Hang. Dad's hang. <laughs> you guys are so messy. <laughs> Well, it's because we got sickums. Oh, my God. Is it like, do you want chicken noodle soup? Aw. And I can throw in a special gel of love. Oh. That's from me? Yes. Well, that's so I don't know nice. how to make the gel. <laughs> <laughs> He's no good. Big, 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 big boy. <laughs> Look how chunky he is. He really is. Oh, are you trying to catch me? Oh, you're trying to bite me? Yep. Yeah, that one's mine. Yeah, I know. I <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. Hang. <laughs> yeah, 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 you, you got it. Yeah, but put it, yep. Perfect. <laughs> why, why do you use this, that shirt for? Working out. Socks, oh my gosh. Is that one mine? Yes. The only thing I'm doing this right now is because my mom and dad got sick again. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god, how many shirts do you have? <laughs> this is a little too much for me. It's a little too much. Yeah. Thanks for doing it. No problem. <laughs> Always have me. That's right. Like, my mom ate something raw and that caused her tummy ache. Yeah, we could, I don't know. It was something last week. I'm not sure. Or it's some kind of like stomach virus going around, but I'm gonna say it's a virus because Nate got it, Dad got it too, right? So it makes sense that it wouldn't necessarily be food poisoning if we both kind of got it. But his hasn't been a stomach. He will. Well, um, is it like happening on his forehead? Like, is it like he's just really forehead? fatigued and tired, and then yeah, it gets his head kind of hurts and stuff. Yeah. Yes, is that mine or that's dad's? Dad's? Yeah. But you know what dad and I did today? What is it? We went to a place that put in um, fluids into us through an IV bag. Okay. In our arm. So we got like a shot. I got a little bruise coming. Oh. It doesn't hurt at all. It's just, uh, it's a little mark, but. Is it like when it's, is there like, in, where do you It like, looks a lot worse than it feels it doesn't it doesn't hurt at all but like is it like that little bruise that's a little red yeah that little and that little poke right there from the needle oh that yeah. little dark thing that's where the poke needle went yep all right how long does it take for it to like help i get so see how i told you guys how sensitive i am that's just from the tape around it from earlier today too like I, it does not take much for my skin my veins look kind of crazy. Okay. Anyway, we did that today. Yeah. And what? How long what? And how long does it take to help your tummy ache? I don't know. I'm just hoping that it will. Um, What's this? Oh, m middle right. Middle right? But, um, yeah, I don't know. I, it took about, like, 45 minutes. Is that socks? Yes. To do the IV... Yeah, we'll see. <gasps> Look at that big boy. Hey. 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 Yes. Yes, he wants it back. All right. This one. Those in the middle right. Okay. These. Oh, these are dads. That's dads. Also, I have to tell you guys, it's almost my last day of school. Almost, yeah. I'm almost done with sixth grade. That's awesome. You did really, really good. 
Yeah. And with that English quiz I passed, I think I'm going to get up to an A now. <laughs> yeah, an A or B, that's awesome. Okay. Last two pieces. That could go in the top or the middle left. Uh, oh, middle left. Middle left. These are smooth ones, and these are yours. Okay. Those are dad's. And then we are... And then we are... We are done. Thanks. Well, let me set up your dirty clothes hamper real quick. Thanks. Oh, usually right here. That'll work. Now we're going to play a trivia quiz. Okay. Hold on. I'll be back, man. Come on down. Okay, guys. So let me find it real quick. What's it called? What's the app? It's like a trivia quiz practice. Is that what it's called? So you can tell them. Because it's fun. It's the one we did before, right? Oh, wait. Trivia star. Trivia star. Let's try to get it to the cam real quick. Mm. So this is what it looks like, guys. With all your fingerprints. <laughs> now we gotta click play for a hundred tokens. Okay, hit me with it. Okay. Oh, we gotta continue with these. Okay. So, which one do you like, Mom? Do pop culture pop? or food? Let's do food. All right. Start quiz. Apples, bananas, and oranges are what? Are types of what? Uh, fruit. Yeah. That's easy. That's easy. What are these popular Chinese appetizers? Oh, what are these? Oh, uh, the sp spring rolls? Yeah. Oh, yes. It's kind Good. of a weird glare on it. In English, pork refers to the meat of which animal? Do you know where pork comes from? Oh, pigs. Yeah. I always miss my pig. Yeah, it was little bobs. Oh, that's s'mores. Yeah, s'mores. Yeah. That was easy. Because I went camping like twice. Yes. Oh, got you. Now, there's a hidden multiplier somewhere. Okay. It's a mystery guess. Ooh, that oh. was a good one. Yeah, that's the times five multiplier. And we have 5,000 trivia stars. Okay. Let's do the Disney. Disney? Are you yeah. good at Disney? Is it like very easy for you? We'll see. Which of the following is not a character owned by Disney? Sonic the Hedgehog. Really? I <laughs> used to play Sonic the Hedgehog a lot. I had a Sega. Which Pixar movie is the song you got a friend in me? Oh, that Toy Story. <laughs> I want to stop real quick because I have another one. Okay. Yes. Oh, the other one we used to do? Yes. All right, what's that one called? Uh, let me find it. It's like a picture of a brain on there, on it. Mm-hmm. Try to find... Oh, here it is. Ginger knowledge. General knowledge. General knowledge. Yeah, general. General. There you go. Knowledge. Yeah. We can only choose standard. Okay. Not pro, because we have to pay for pro mode. That's how they get you. Yeah, okay. All right, which of the following animals can't jump? I think it's elephants. I think you're right. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. Yeah. That's kind of easy because that's from science. Yeah. What is the main ingredient in ice cream? Ice? No. Mm -hmm. Well, they had to freeze it. But what is? what are they freezing? The freezing milk. Well, like they're making like vanilla ice cream. Then that would have vanilla, but just ice cream itself, yeah. yeah. Yes. What substance is no longer used in ther thermometers due to safety concerns? Alcohol, mercury, benzene, or water? I don't know this one. I'm going to say mercury because I don't think that's good yes. for anyone. There yes, you go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What is the softest substance in the world? Diamond, mercury, talc, or iron? Talc. Talc um, or talc, iron? Talc. Talc. Okay. Which one is the soft leaf? Soft substance. Talc. Talc? What's it's a like talc? powder. Oh, powder? Yeah. Like baby powder? Yeah. Which of these medical fields, fields deal with blood? 
Do you know? No. So oncology, endocrinology, geriatrics, or hematology. So you know how they like basically all end with ology? Oh yeah. So you really just have to remember the first half of what something stands for. And blood is hema or hemo. Oh. Yeah. This one. Yeah. Cause you're saying that H word first. Yeah. A hey, now I can't help you with this. No. <laughs> a crepuscular That's a hard word. <laughs> animal becomes active at what time? A crepuscular Dawn, dusk, midday, late night. I know nocturnal's late night, mm -hmm. but a crepuscular. Let's say dawn. This one? Yeah, why not? Oh, dusk. dusk. Which of these type dinosaurs have really long necks? I know. Or right, wait, do I know? Yeah, I know. It's a. Sort of. Is it a Tysaurus Rex? That's a big one. Yeah. That's not, they don't got long necks though, right? Oh, no. No, they got little like, hands. Uh, how can you find their necks on a tie? But there's one dinosaur that stands out that has a big long neck like a giraffe. Oh, um, uh, I don't know. I think it's Brachia. I could be wrong. <laughs> oh, no, I'm right. <laughs> you really know your dinosaurs, do you? What do Alexander Graham... Bell, Bell and Fint. Fint. The bold, the television, the car, or the telephone? I feel like I should know this. Which one? I don't know. A to B. I don't know. Just pick a guess. It's okay if you get it wrong. For whatever reason, I just want to say the telephone. Okay. But I know that's wrong. Oh. I got it! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Which animal feeds most feeds oh almost my. exclusively on bamboo. Oh my god, that's easy. Pandas! Like combo. Yeah. Another ad. Another ad. But this is fake though. It's fake. <laughs> so we have to tell him. He's like, hey, we can get money, guys. <laughs> and I always say it, and these guys say it's fake. <coughs> scam! But you know what? I don't like it when you say it's a scam. Cause it's not that it's, okay, it's not that it's necessarily fake. Okay. But you don't just get money for free. You have to put money on it. What? Yeah, and then hope to get money back. You know how, like, you know, the gambling? Oh, yeah. It's like you that. Always, it's like a stealer of money. It is a stealer of money. But guess what? Remember that. About what percentage of the Earth's surface is water? Oh. 10, 50, 70, 90. What is, um, what is it? It wouldn't be 90. Okay. I think, I think it's 70. Okay. Yeah. Good job. How many sides does a... Dodic... Dodic... I can't... Dodic... I don't know. Dodagon. Dodagon? Dodagon? Dodagon. Well, yeah. I've never heard of that, so I'm going to well, go with 12. Yeah, <laughs> just by default. Well, you know why? Because in octagon, oct means eight. Right. Yeah. Myology, so remember I was telling you about ology, right? Yeah. Is the study of what? So you just have to know what myo means. Myo. Which I don't. So. Uh, it's not rat. It's not? No. What if it is? Grass. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> light muscles. I don't think it's not white. I think it's muscles. Yeah. yeah. I thought that was, I'm thinking more like kinesiology. What creature can lift up to 50 times its weight body? Oh, it's ants. Body weight? Ants. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Well, all right. Because I heard of a YouTuber have ants that can carry large stuff. Half its weight. Really? Which country has the largest... The ca longest coastline. The longest coastline. Canada, Denmark, 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 and England and Russia. I'm going to assume... <laughs> it's either Russia or Denmark. Really? I think it's Russia. But wouldn't it be Canada or no? No, 
I think it's talking about like the longest state. No. No, longest coastline. So like so ocean of brown. Oh. You know, like that's California a, has the whole Pacific Ocean off to the that's side. The and right near it is Canada, so it has to be Canada. I, yeah. yeah, see? About how many countries are there in the world? 100, 200, 300, 400. Do you know? Yeah. I believe I know, but I could be wrong. I believe I'm going to say 200. Do it. You know what? I was thinking the same. You know why? Because when the Olympics happen, they always talk about it of like over 200 countries coming together. Okay, yep. which of the following is not a part of the brain? The brain. The brain stem. It's brain stem, cere cerebrum, uh, cuboid, cerebellum. I think it's cerebellum. No, cerebellum is part of the brain. Oh. That's a big part. This one does. I think so. Right. Cuboid? Yeah, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> okay, what country is shaped like a... A boot. Uh, it's a country, Canada. so it's not a state. Okay. Which state is shaped like a boot? It's not Canada. No, but what state is? I'm just asking if you know. I forgot. You forgot? It's at the bottom, huh? Yeah. It starts with the L. Louisiana. Yeah, yeah, good. But we're talking about what? We are talking about the country. I don't know. I'm going to say Italy. Italy? <laughs> All right. What is the name of the oldest star in the galaxy? I'm going to say that last one. Matusal. Yeah, it sounds like an old name. Okay. <laughs> was a technical term for a lie detector. I know this one. Polygraph. Yeah. How do you know? I just have seen a lot of Lifetime movies. <laughs> have you ever went to a lie detector? I never have. Mm-mm. Okay. Most people don't have to do them in their life. Why? Well, they're usually left for true criminal things. Oh. And we're not criminals. Yeah, because we don't have a criminal license. But we don't have a criminal record. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's good, my blue. Yeah, it's time for a break. Yeah. Bye, fans. Thanks for doing my, my clothes for me. Yep. And thanks for playing with me. Yes. All right. Anyway, so yeah, this all started last weekend and it's Wednesday today. So I'm still kind of like, it was, but it's weird because yesterday I was actually like the best that I was. I mopped a floor, no less. I mean, what? I was like, okay, I'm on the mend. And then today I don't feel bad per se, but definitely not as good as yesterday. And then we went and did these IV things. Um, I, I want to give it a better, uh, like, when I was there, it was, I felt really good, actually. It was, it, well, plus they have these big massage chairs that you're in, and they're really, really nice. Um, so while there, it was, it was good. But I, I think you kind of expect to, like, walk away from those places, like, I'm on top of the world, right? But to be fair, we only did do um, the true, like, hydration package. We didn't do any, like, added vitamins and stuff. Can add up, you know? But I just really wanted to stay hydrated. And then Nate, too, to just kind of get ahead of it. And, um, I don't know. I've just, we were both, like, we came home and, like, kind of crashed of, like, kiddo was going to get home in like an hour uh from when we got back and we both like took an hour cat nap type thing and it was like immediate but again I think it was almost like getting a massage though and that's normal too to be just kind of whacked afterwards um and also we're doing this because we don't feel good not to not doing it when we actually do already feel good do you know what I'm saying so I don't want to say that like it made me feel worse or anything because I don't think that's fair. I'm doing it for a purpose. Even one of the doctors there was even said, like, you're here not for maintenance per se. You're here to fix this problem, right? Um, but yeah, no, we, it was it was cool. I would totally do it again and see. But I'm just hoping this helps because that's been, like, the big thing this last week. It's just been um, vomit, fun, and on... I, I first thought Nate still thinks like a food poisoning thing, but then why would he have gotten like sick too? 
the same week. It doesn't really make sense. We did do an at home like COVID test because a lot of people are saying now too that like these things are happening like where stomach bug issues are then turning into that or people are finding out that's what it is. We did that yesterday. Yeah, yesterday that was negative for both of us, which is good. But I'm just saying if mine really was food poisoning, unless it's just coincidence that like Nate doesn't feel great now too and it's his own thing you know um then I guess it could still be food poisoning but anyway yeah vomiting but on the other end of it sorry if TMI but here we are I'm like completely like almost immediately from when this started like constipated it's just this way not that way and like I've just gotten so dehydrated and I am someone so like regular normal you know and so that has just not been fun and I do not like it and like my pee and everything too it's just it's dark in comparison to what it normally is again and that's why I'm like Nate well Nate really and you know you know he's terrified of needles but like he's like we need to go we need to go do it and I'm like no it don't, whatever I'll just drink water you know but it's been hard to drink a lot of water because my stomach does not feel great and so you just you don't want to you know be full right I guess um so I get it but yeah he wanted to do it but you know he has the fear of needles and stuff but he did it and uh you know they check your blood pressure and stuff his was through the freaking roof and we had to we've told you guys this before we had to tell him yeah that's normal for him right now in this moment but it was fine it was totally fine um anyway I think it was Sunday I couldn't even like lay on my stomach like on my side even because it was so just bloated beyond belief feeling and Oh, luckily that did subside Monday and that was like the best thing ever. And I'd say since Monday, I'm like on the mend, but I still get little feelings, little waves. Even when we're playing a little game and stuff together, like I, I there's little waves that come of like where I feel nauseous, but I, I have not thrown up in two or three days now. So that's good. But I d just still kind of feel it. And my appetite is literally none. And that part is really weird for me too, because I'm so used to like eating on a routine even of like, just because I work out in the mornings, which I have not even considered. Um, and I eat after, and then I usually get hungry around two. And then I finish it up at dinner at like 4.35 and you know, I'm out by eight. <laughs> None of this is happening right now at all. Like at all. Um, I, I don't know. I, I, I have to force myself to eat and it is super bland at this point of like, it's, it's that point where like you say, uh, a food and I'm like, Whoa. yeah, no, I just got hiccups too. I don't know. <sighs> so yeah, Nate still thinks food poisoning. I think it could be a little viral thing, like a stomach virus thing. And I posted some of this on Instagram and many of you, unfortunately, I'm sorry, have said that you're just had it going through it now. Oh, I heard something. Family member had it just recently, like it's going around. So I think that's what it is. And all of you have that have dealt with it now have said one week one week and so if I go off of that logic I basically have till Saturday and it's only Wednesday to feel like better and I'm like ew <laughs> you know anyway thought I would say hello hello hope you enjoyed the trivia we've been doing that a lot just in little spurts of like hey keep that mind fresh you guys know I do my crosswords I do same kind of thing anyway I'll keep you guys posted. Thanks for hanging out.